a quick video of my room and Red Planet Cebu. This is my first time in Cebu. And we just booked, well, we came in around, I want to say 12, 1 a.m. So we booked this room for just, for just the night and now we're moving on to another place. Uh, we just wanted to check this place out because it was a nice uh, option for like a short stay. Um, but it's, it's not bad at all. Uh, this is the bathroom area. Bathroom area is nice. One of the things that I really like is there's a lot of water pressure. Like, it's, it's heavy. And this shower is pretty amazing in, in regards to water pressure. Try to turn it on for you just so you can get an idea. The water pressure is really good. For Filipino standards, it is really good. And the hot water is very nice. There was no shortage of hot water. I, I, I've only been here a day, so, I mean one night, so I can't, I don't know how consistent it is. Maybe I, I just caught it on a very good day, but I'm very, very happy and very pleased with the hot water. Uh, they have a blow dryer here, TV, but we had some trouble operating the TV. Couldn't get the channels to pretty much work. So we just decided to pass out and that was it. So we didn't necessarily use the TV. No reviews on that. Air conditioner. The room is uh, fairly small, but it gets the job done. If you just come, if you're just coming to crash, you know, and you have other you have other plans and Cebu things that you want to do, this is a nice place to pretty much keep your stuff. Um, there is no refrigerator, so you, there's, there's no storage of food or drinks. Another thing was we were told that they don't, they don't allow uh, stinky foods. I would think that all foods have a particular smell, so I took that as don't bring food into the room. They don't have a restaurant, but they have these weird, um, like, well, they have partners. So pretty much what happens is you can utilize uh, these partners that they have. 7-Eleven, Puso, Bistro, and Bar. They have buffets. And pretty much what they offer is coupons to these places. Um, yeah. And up. Oh, printing services they don't have a phone so what they recommend that you do is to get this particular app on your smartphone and that is pretty much how you request services at the front desk and things like that which is very interesting to say the least here's the safe I, I didn't necessarily I don't I don't use the safe much but this looks like a very nice good safe uh, you can't you can't fit a laptop in there, or at least I don't think so. But yeah, that's the safe, the lights, and this is one of those those rooms where you use your key card to power all the electricity. You can control the air conditioner through here, not through the panel that it's physically on the air conditioner. Pretty much, when you remove the key, all power will go off, and when you put the key the key card in uh, the power will start you use the key card also for uh, the elevators to to request for the elevator to either come get you or to go to other floors all right and pretty much that's it this is Ariel Pence signing off feel free to ask me any questions adios